Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So as you can see we have two special guests and today I will be doing the parents tag. So you get to meet my parents. If this is something that you're interested in, just continue to watch. Hey guys, so today I wanted you to meet the two beautiful people that made this beautiful human being called myself. <laughs> This is my mother and father, and today we'll be doing the <laughs> parent tag so you guys can get to know them a little bit and see how, basically, this wonderful human being was created, and that's how I'm myself. So, okay, okay. meet my mom, Hi. and this is my dad. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> he is a man of little words, but That's papa. not true. Well, if he don't know you. Oh, okay. Okay, so... The first question is, what was I like as a child? Anybody can go first. She was a little diva when she was a little kid. She didn't like sand to be on her feet. Loved sandals, but hate to be in the sand and sand got in her feet, on her feet. Still don't like it to this day. But oh. she loves the beach, though. I don't understand that part. <laughs> but anyway. I consider her to be my little angel. Aww. Huh? In his eyesight. <laughs> Totally, totally <laughs> in his eyesight. Uh -huh. Little angel, really? <laughs> okay. All right. What do you guys think of me about making YouTube videos? How do you feel about me making YouTube videos? It's up to you. Uh, my belief is that as long as you achieve your dream, that's all that matters to me. And we know that each and every one of us have different, different dreams and different calling. So whatever you decide to do, my heart is always there to support you. Well, on my behalf, I think she's doing a very good job. Um, as I watch her videos, it's always an encouraging thing. It's things that she tells people, it's encouraging, it's inspiring, as well as knowledgeable. She gives insight to a lot of things that she's gone through, what she's experienced, things like that. So making the videos are very encouraging. Oh, they're uh, so supportive. Right. All right, what is something funny I did when I was younger? <laughs> funny. Hmm. Well, she had a pose when she was little. She'd been less than about six or seven months. And I used to always hold her in my hand and I'd just make this funny. <laughs> and she would repeat after me and I thought that was so funny. Uh, with me, the funny part was when she always wanted to follow me around in the house and her dad told her, well, if you want to follow your mom, you got to get out, out of my arms and walk. And she did just that. Oh, and that every was the first then, time I walked? Yeah. Oh, so that okay. was kind of funny because he thought she would have never gotten down. She thought, oh, this is my little angel. She will always stay mom. She would never follow the mom. But he proved her wrong. <laughs> so. All right. This is a funny one. And I think I know the answer. If you had to rename me, what would it be? <laughs> Edwina. That's what he always wanted oh to name my, her. I am so happy. <laughs> it was like, not. babe, come on, let's name her Edwina. I said, you're not naming oh my child my Edwina. Because Ed his name is Edward. So he thought Edwina would be so pretty. That is, no. no. No, that was not the name for the child. I'm sorry. I don't think I would make a good Edwina. So I'm glad but they no, chose it was funny. Nikita. That was funny. <laughs> He was like, babe, we're not going to name her Edwina? No, you will not name my child Edwina. No, I'm sorry. So she ended up with Nikita. Okay. But somewhere down the line, he wanted Edwina to be in the midst of it. I was like, oh, uh, no. No, not going to happen. All right. Where would you guys like to see me in 10 years? In 10 years, um, you having your heart desired, you actually accomplishing everything that you desire to accomplish. Um, having your own business. Well, what I'd like to see you in 10 years, as I always taught you and told you that you create your own path, create your own journey. Wherever you go, let, you, let it be your heart to lead you. Because we all gotta live our own life. I never want you to come back and say, hey, oh daddy, I want to do this. And that's why I told her, hey, you chose your, you chose your path, have a way to achieve those goals. If you do that, you can do anything that you want to do. 
So whatever your goal is 10 years from now, that's what I want you to be. Aww. Aww. All right, what's something I do that annoys you? I can show you one thing, but my mom's not going to lie. <laughs> I'll skip that one. <laughs> I don't want them Mommy. to ban you on the... No, <laughs> I'm not going there today. That, you, no. you <laughs> that, she that, hates. Oh my God, that bothers me. She oh. has this thing that tickled me under my neck and I can't stand that And part. she hates for people's feet to touch her. So I will purposely put my foot on her to annoy her because she hate, She has a thing with feet. She can't stand it. it it's crazy. The only person that can actually put their feet on me is my grandson. Oh, Lord. Everybody else is like, and then at times that irritates me as well. So, But so, he doesn't know that. <laughs> but. <laughs> All right. How was I in school? Up until high school? <laughs> she was good. Disrespectful. Yeah, up until high school. She tried to get out of hand, but she was okay. Papa. She was always because I, I was the type of father I would be to her school every other week, oh, yes. and before class, each and every one of her teachers knew me, and they know that if she ever gave them any problem, they had my cell. At the time, it was beeper; it wasn't cell yet. They could have called <laughs> me, and I think I only got one page, and that was in the eighth grade. But besides that, she was excellent. Thank you, uh -huh. Papa. No, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> okay. That's not quite. But we're not going to go there. All right. And then final question. What's your favorite moment of us together? Every moment that we have together is my favorite. Aww. It's one that I never want to forget. And as we encounter, and you have grown, and you have your family now, each and every time that we get together, it's a very memorable moment that I will always treasure. I love family time when all of us get together. It's hilarious because I sit and I watch her and her sibling, her brother, go at it. And it's like, and they always want me to compare, be on one of them sides. Mom, isn't this right? Mom, isn't this right? No, I'm not taking sides with any one of them. So it's also, family time. Also, I must include it that I have the greatest G side. And if you don't know what G side stands for, <laughs> greatest son in law. Yes. Yes. Yes, he is a part of the family. Even yes. though this is a daughter tag, but I guess, you know, mm. he is a part of me, so he had to be included. That is my son. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. That is the end of the parent tag. You guys now got a little inside scoop of what I get on a daily basis from my parents. This is why I am who I am, because I had a great upbringing with very supportive parents, and that's what made me who I am. So until next time, beautiful people, have a great day.